funny memories. I, I kind of, I think it's always rolls around our family, I think for me, because most gigs that I play are with my family and often my dad often talks before he speaks, so he would say a few funny little things like, you know, I play the violin and I, and I fiddle a lot on stage, obviously, country fiddle, and so did my granddad, so you can always imagine what would come out of my dad's mouth <laughs> And then you'd laugh kind of awkwardly on stage going, that was awkward. <laughs> it's music, I swear. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'd just come out of the ranges and we, I was probably about an hour or so out of Tamworth and I remember getting stuck on a, on a back road for about 10 minutes um, while I was waiting for a, a herd of cattle just to take their own sweet time to, to cross the road and, uh, and then I had, could go on from there. So I definitely remember that and uh, I guess that was def you know, a reminder that I was, uh, I was getting pretty close. I think my funniest memory of the Tamworth Country Music Festival was doing my first gig in the Toyota Star Maker Grand Final. I was really nervous because I was the first person out there. So, you know, casually packing my DAX. Um, and then they forgot to turn on the front of house speakers. But it sounded amazing uh, in the foldback, of course. So, yeah, a treat for the band. <laughs> I think for me the funniest memory was we used to do an Elvis show in the in the in the uh, the leagues club, and all the artists used to come and we used to get three or four costumes that they would all dress on. And Becky Cole came up and was in the middle of her song and her pants fell down to her ankles. That was pretty funny. You know the whole thing is fun, but I think probably for me it's a funny memory that I actually don't know why it was funny because I was backstage at uh, Country Turns Pink ready to go on stage and Darren Carr, who's a ventriloquist, introduced me but because I was backstage I couldn't hear what he said about me and the whole audience absolutely went into hysterics and I walked on stage and they were all laughing at me and I, I still don't know why. Thanks Darren Carr. Uh, during the cavalcade, I don't know how many years ago it was now, but um, I was on this beautiful big float with the uh, Liverpool Plains farmers and we're singing up the country and uh, just how magnificent they are out there and uh, all of a sudden the heavens opened and uh, down it came and we were utterly soaked. Uh, the boots were all filled with water. I couldn't have been more wet if I was sitting in a bathtub. But uh, we just kept on waving and uh, true to the beautiful people of Tamworth and the country music fans, they stood out there with us and uh, cheered us on and it was a beautiful moment and uh, I suppose quite funny now. My funniest memory of the festival is probably uh, the 2019 Golden Guitar Awards um, when we were photographed matching the carpet. So it was myself and some other country music artists laying on the floor. That's probably my funniest memory. Look, my funniest memory dates back to 80, 81, 82 with the large circus tent we actually put up for the Country Music Awards and this storm hit on the third year and these large uh, uh, circus tent poles were jumping around and, and fell onto a, a lady's handbag and she was waiting there in this ferocious wind and these dangerous conditions and she was looking down waiting for the pole to move again so she could recover a handbag. My funniest moment at Tamworth was probably uh, sitting backstage at the 2019 awards. Uh, I couldn't find a barber that was open and the, the makeup ladies would give me a little trim but Casey Chambers came up behind me with a pile of hair extensions, draped them over my head and go, there, that's much better. That's how you should go out there. This is going way back when we were just kids knocking around with the Coggins, the Dennehy's. Uh, we had uh, also the Shadlows out there. It was a whole lot of fun and we were getting a bit raucous and next thing you know, we had a visit from the boys in blue. <laughs> The funniest memory of this festival is probably the drive here. Dad's always the driver. And as we're going over the Great Dividing Range, he makes sure to tell us every time that we're making our way over the Great Dividing Range. And you ask me like, oh, what's the favorite part of the Great Dividing Range? I'm like, oh, I don't know, Dad. It's nice. The cows. The serenity. <laughs> serenity, so that's uh, Good old what, Dad. Good old dad. <laughs> <laughs> that's not even that funny. But, uh, <laughs> It's funny if you're there. You gotta, you gotta be there. Oh. <laughs>